Right. <laughs> All right, let me set up the recording. I, I got to do the intro. I hate doing the intro. It's my least favorite part. I'll do it. All right. I think I know what I'm going to say. It's my third one, so I should know by now. But. All right, here we go. <laughs> Hey everybody, this is the Avion with the Archbishop of Genesian Players. This is the 53rd and 54th season president. And I'm here interviewing some of our seniors because, you know, Corona's kind of messed up their last show, their final circle. They didn't get to experience that. So coming here to talk to them for a little bit, talk about their Genesian experience and uh, see what's been going on. How you doing, Gracie? I'm good. <laughs> Real quick start, how's online school been? Uh, some days are good, some days are really long. Yeah, uh, I hear from a lot of the rubble guys. It's like, oh, just two hours and I'm good. How is it at Chappelle? Oh, sometimes it's 30 minutes and sometimes I spend the whole day doing homework, so. <laughs> right, really just depends. How many days you got left? I'm done. I ended on Thursday. Oh, wow. So you're just chilling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> gotcha. So I, explain to me a little on how you ended up getting in Genesians. I think you were a little bit of a late bloomer, weren't you? I was. <laughs> um, I always had friends in Genesians, like Lauren and Noah. And mm -hmm. like I knew of you and Austin and Allie, but mm -hmm. we were never close. And then... Um, I love doing makeup, and I always post it everywhere, and, um, Esh <laughs> found my makeup and started texting me and my parents and, like, asking mm -hmm. me to come and do makeup for my fair lady, but since it was so early in the year, I'm in Bannon, mm -hmm. Chapel, at some, like, school, so I couldn't right. do it, so I was going to start with the Crucible, and mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey. Hey, that, we're still counting that, Gracie. You are a bona fide Genesian now. You're like, you're going to get the medal, and you're invited to all the events to get together. You're, you're forever. You can't get rid of that. <laughs> so the Crucible was going to be your first Genesian show. Did you ever get a chance to uh, actually go to rehearsal? Yeah, I knew that I was going to be backstage because there was a, like a, a makeup change. Mm -hmm in the middle so I wanted to go to most of the rehearsals so I could actually see some of the shows right some of the shows, so. gotcha so what what were you going to be doing during the show what's the big makeup your uh, change you're talking about so there's this part in the crucible where John Proctor gets beat up because he's in jail so mm -hmm. Noah would come backstage and I would have about like 15, 10 minutes to change him into look all beat up and bruised and bleeding. And then he'd go back gotcha. Thank goodness you're good with makeup. I've seen, uh, uh, it was like, your, I've seen some of your videos on either TikTok or Instagram. And like you had one where you had like half yeah. face. And that was really cool. <laughs> so it wasn't hard doing it that quick though. Yeah, the first time I did it, I practiced with him and it took about like, 30 minutes just to wow. get all of the cuts in and then so I was like oh we really like this cut down mm -hmm. gotcha so since, since that was the only show you've actually been a part of um tell me some of the other shows you have experiences with like shows you have a scene or you knew people in um well, I've been in band and chocolates for like since mm -hmm. eighth grade. So I know everyone that's in both. So right. I've been to Barnum and My Fair Lady and She Loves Me. And mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I went to Richard and just a bunch of shows like that. Just a right, bunch of right. Ones. <laughs> right. So uh, mostly the musicals though, right? You like musicals? Yeah, I do. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. So... What was your what was your feeling of the, the, the time you were in Genesians? How did you what, what kind of grasp or feel did you get at the club? Um. Well, when I went to the practices for the Crucible, I'd never actually been to a practice, so I've never seen like how 
all the lines come through. And mm -hmm. so when they're reading from their books, I thought it was really interesting how like they're just reading and mm -hmm. Ash is taking notes and then they stop the scene and they run through the whole thing and she critiques right. them and she's just so good at noticing every little detail even if there's so many people on stage mm -hmm. and she can tell like three people like she's just so good at <laughs> critiquing everybody and being stern but still being like nice and funny and making jokes and stuff right right yeah she, she definitely has a great way of keeping getting her point across but not making it in a, like a a, a man that would make you feel bad at all. She she just yeah. says it very nicely and yeah. really just helps nudge you in the right direction. And that, that's what a director's supposed to do. Um, so like you've seen a bunch of the shows. What was your favorite scene from a show you've seen? Or yeah, seen or been a part of? Okay, my, my favorite show was probably She Loves Me. Mm -hmm. I saw it three times and wow. <laughs> my favorite scene from there um it was probably when they're when george and amali are at dinner and they're arguing and he <laughs> tells her the story about how the woman with the leg and they never found her or her book <laughs> i right. love that scene <laughs> that's so that, it's really a funny scene um so i i, I would like to talk it's been a big part of your life, obviously. Talk a little about your chaplet and your band experience real quick. What what was that like? Yeah, um I'm pretty sure I'm like the third or first third or fourth person to ever do it in like mm -hmm. however many years the band and chaplets have been together. Mm -hmm. Um but I'm pretty sure I'm the only one that's done both for all five years. They usually mm -hmm. pick one their senior year right. and it's extremely hard because <laughs> we work so closely together and being in both like you you obviously have to put one first so mm -hmm. i was a chapelet first and then anything where the chapelets weren't doing anything i was in band and right. being in both is just great because you get to see both sides because they're so completely different and being friends with both sides and just like, I don't know, it's just great. <laughs> no, I understand. You had a good time all five years? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was That's great. Good. So, I've been asking everybody, you know, uh, Janice and yeah, we normally have a final circle for our seniors. Uh, mm -hmm. Obviously, our last show was interrupted because of the coronavirus. What would you like to say to some of the other seniors and some of the other people in the club? Uh, I just wish I had started earlier and wish I had the opportunity to be more involved because I really wish we could have gotten closer and got to know everybody mm -hmm. and helped more. <laughs> hey, I understand, but um, I, I can speak on behalf of the club here. You are a great boon to have in the club and everyone, your presence made everything the better. So we really <laughs> appreciate that you actually joined and you helped out. And you've, always, you've been a big supporter even when you weren't in the club. You saw the shows and you're just, you know, great to be around. So I can, I can say that confidently. Um, are there any, any final thoughts or anything you want to talk about uh, before we go? Um, I don't think so. I just... You got any funny stories? Um... Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, another thing that I really liked about, mm -hmm. um, like, being in the rehearsals, but also, like, seeing the different plays, like, mm -hmm. how, like, they can just change, like, from going to, like, seeing Noah and Allie and she loves me and then seeing them in the crucible and how they can just change and mm -hmm. how Josh can go from like seeing like perspective and being all like bubbly and mm -hmm. witty to like yelling at Tichuba during rehearsal right. about like being a witch like just how they're so different and right. seeing like she loves me three times like 
it was never the same every time. And yeah. just seeing how you can play off each other, mm -hmm. even if you do mess up and <laughs> like you can fix it and like just make different jokes or like emphasize different parts to make like right. whether how the crowd is feeling that night. Mm -hmm. I just yeah. Really like that. Yeah, it, it, theater really is. If it, was a, if it was a sport, it'd be ping pong because it's really yeah. bouncing back and forth between you and the audience. And you're really, your move and how you're performing is really based on what they did. So, you know, not every, every time you hit it there, it's not going to be the same hit back. So, yeah, it's really, yeah. it's really like ping pong with the audience. And it's really, see, look, you're smart. You picked up on that real quick. Um, <laughs> I forgot to ask, um, what's next for Gracie? Where are you going? Oh, I'm going to Southeastern, and I'm going to be a nursing student. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> are you excited? Are, are, you gonna, uh, are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. I'm really excited. I'm excited to move out and go into mm -hmm. dorms with all my friends and right. learn new things, new experiences. Right. right. Do you know your roommate? I don't. I think I'm going to get a random one. I think that'd be uh -huh. really fun. Yeah, you can make me friends. <laughs> um, my roommate my freshman year was uh, this guy named Trevor Maggio from Rumble. Great guy. We didn't fight at all. Love him. Shout out to Trevor Maggio. Great guy. But um, <laughs> Gracie, uh, I just wanted I just want to tell you, your, your presence made Janisha's all the better. We really appreciate it. You did come around before it was too late. And, um, <laughs> I'm really happy you're just a part of the club. Thank you. <laughs> All right, Gracie, you stay safe. Have a good day. Okay, goodbye. Bye.